Hello everyone, Heap here and this is something I wanted to share after over half a year of work. This is a fully secure, authoritative, character controller based movement system for use with Unity multiplayer. This feature rich system is secure, fast, highly customizable, easy to extend, has an ability to record and play back the gameplay and best of all, it's free. First of all, you can move around just like with any movement system, jump, sprint and crouch. Knowing this is based on the character controller, you can also slide off the steep surfaces. Everything apart from the sideways movement has animations blended with the mechanism system. You can customize settings like speed, jump height, enable or disable bunny hopping and strafing. These settings are saved as scriptable objects and can be swapped very easily. You can enable the trust of client results difference to make the overall game experience for the clients with unreliable connection better, but this is rarely needed. The system is secure. The server decides uh, where the player is and the player just predicts. As you can see, this wall was only spawned on the server, the client does not see it, but because it is on the server, the client cannot go through. Inputs gathering can be easily swapped in and out with anything that suits your game. It does not have to be first or third person movement. Let's talk performance. It is rather good. We have very low overhead with the CPU time being very small. Garbage collection allocations only happen on the engine side and they are very small. One of the last additions to the system was the ability to record the gameplay. To make the state of the object recorded, you just create a prefab with the recordable object component, add the handler interface, add the prefab to the global recordable objects array, set the index on the prefab accordingly and done. Just set the name any way you want and call the record function. A basic UI is already set up for you. You can just stop and replay the recording anytime you want. The handler interfaces are easy to add features on. Just create a script deriving from any interface like base recording handler, override the methods, call the base class functions and done. I hope this video gave you the basic idea of what my movement system is and maybe it will be useful for your project. The system is available on GitHub under the MIT license. You can also check my Unity forums post on this system. If this was helpful, don't hesitate to click that like button, share the video with others and subscribe. My name is Heap and I'm out.